Hello, I'm Fred Prony with Vita Pharma, and today I'm going to show you how to use OxyBee to fight Varroa mites. OxyBee is a veterinary medicine based on oxalic acid to fight Varroa mites, and OxyBee is registered in the European only, European Union only. Let's begin with our protective equipment. First, you'll need safety glasses, acid-resistant gloves, and protective clothes. You definitely want to protect yourself from any risk of splashing product. With OxyB, it is not necessary to wear a respirator, which is usually the case when handling pure oxalic acid. You will also need a container of warm water, 30 to 35 degrees, and a syringe or a drenching gun or an automatic doser. In the box, you will find a bottle containing oxalic acid with water and glycerin, and two sachets of powder that contain sugar and essential oils as well as a complete construction sheet. Glycerol improves the adhesiveness of the liquid of the bees. Essential oils are included to give a pleasant smell for the bees. The shelf life of OxyBee is two years. After opening and mixing, it can be stored for one year in the refrigerator. I would advise that you write the date and the day directly on the bottle, not to forget it. You should also keep the batch number and date treatment for your records. All right, now let's do the preparation. We're going to take our bottle and place it in a warm basin to warm the product slightly so that the product dissolves easily. Your bees will better accept the product if it's warmer, more or less kind of the temperature of the bunch of bees. We're going to open the bottle and we are going to pour the contents of each sachet into the bottle. Sometimes a funnel makes this action much easier. Once the contents of both sachets are in the bottle, we're going to put the cap on and shake. This way the powder is well dissolved. The outside temperature during the application should be at least 3 degrees Celsius. Do not use the product with supers on. You have to treat outside of your honey float. Also make sure that the colony does not have brood, otherwise the treatment would lose much of its effectiveness. Like with any oxalic acid, oxalic acid is usually used during the winter for this reason. OxyB must be administered with a syringe between 5 and 6 milliliters of product per interstage space with bees. It's better to go slowly and put the product on the entire length of the bee way. The dose by bee way has to be adapted according to the presence of the bees. If the bee way on the side of the hive is half occupied, you will only use half of the dose. Don't exceed a total amount of 54 milliliters of this product per hive. But there should be no problem with 10 frame hives. Use of the syringe and dribbling with OxyB does take some practice. After a while, you'll get very good at it. You will notice that mites will drop quite quickly and that we will have a large mite mortality. Thanks for watching. We appreciate it. And please subscribe to the Vita Pharma channel.